Walking out of the Fairchild and Martindale Library towards Roush Business Center of Lehigh University, a sculpture named Have a Seat can be found on the left. Made with center blocks, stone, and steel in 2018, the piece was created by artist Karen Olivier. Born in Trinidad and Tobago, the artist creates sculptures, installations, and public art that interacts multiple histories and memories with present-day narratives. As you walk around the piece, multiple square-shaped holes can be found on its volume, while audiences can interact with the piece by glancing the world through little holes from a different perspective, they can also observe each other when there are multiple of them around. In this way, Olivier intends to present monuments as conductors that will transport and reflect the landscape, people, and activities surrounding it. Olivier's pieces often resonate with the audiences by creating an interactive experience. In a sense, I need the viewers to complete a piece, she once said. Initially illustrated in bench seating for one created in 2005, audience movement around the piece is part of the experience she wishes to create. The piece only functions if the audience sits on it. In this way, the monument asks its audiences to neglect itself and transmit their intention to the environment around, when suddenly the gallery becomes the object. Have a seat creates a similar chemistry to this one, only the shift between object and subject is played between the sculpture and the campus environment surrounding it. According to the artist, have a seat was a gift to the students. At the end of the day, it would be nice to have a sight of respite, staring at the green grass and blue sky, hence the location the artist and the university collectively chose to display the sculpture has profound meanings as well. Right next to the student library and in between academic buildings, Have a Sea seems like a place of escape, available for student population to stop by and relax. Although the piece generates a public experience, there's a feeling of subtle, more simple gestures like seating alone that allows a sense of intimacy. With Have a Seat, Olivier challenges the boundary dividing public and private spaces. In a time of information overload, where access to communication takes place continuously in our lives, the notion of private and public spaces has, in a sense, lost its meanings. The way we treat public spaces now has changed due to the invention of cell phone and portable tablets. In a public environment, we can also enjoy an intimate moment. On the other hand, an intimate moment is crucial for taking a break in between the fast-paced lifestyle this era has forced upon us.